Welcome back to Hit Points Gaming. Today is our third episode of the People of the Sun campaign, and it is a Hit Points Gaming first. Do you know why? Because we're going to fight a spider. We are going to fight the spider -cliss. And uh, I'm afraid of spiders. Me too. Great. So, uh, Me too. Very, I very much so. I don't really know if we're ready for this fight, but I want to try it out. And like all of our fights before, any of our new fights, I don't go on. I, I don't see the best strategy on how to fight this. We don't look at the AI cards this. or the hit deck or... I just have a good understanding by reading the rules. I will scan the hit locations to see, okay, is there something that I should tell you what we should be aware of? And I know they have some special hit location cards in this. I think we can cut its legs off, which is going to cause an event at the end if we do all eight. But, yeah, we're not sure if uh, we're ready for this or not. And you're going to find out uh, along with us. Um, I want to put this out there. Um... If anyone is new to our channel, uh, or even if you're not, if you're a returning subscriber, um, let um, let your friends know if they're interested at all in playing Kingdom Death Monster and they want to see what this game's all about. Now's a really good time to join and subscribe, only because we're going be going through this campaign. And we're at the beginning. We're at the beginning, and it, and it's really great to um, answer everybody's comments. Uh, point us along on the direct, on the best path and how maybe to defeat a creature because I like hearing from you rather than going out and doing my own research um, because we get some of your pointers, what, what good weapons we should bring. So um, I think that's the best part when we do our campaigns is interaction with our viewers. And so if there's anyone out there that's ever been interested, um, one of your friends that you want to get them on board with this, uh, definitely send it send it along and uh, yeah. Well, play. yeah. The only reason that I'm playing this game is because of you guys out there. <laughs> you know that. Wow, that's, I, that's kind of messed up. Right? Are you kidding me? We would be playing so many other games if it weren't for the Kingdom Death Monster fans. I can name a couple. Okay, go ahead. We would be playing the Last Time Stories. We would be finishing Arkham Card Game before the baby comes. We would be. Um, uh, we would be playing... Give me two more. Okay. We would be playing Gloomhaven, probably. And we would probably play... Well, there's a lot of legacy games that we haven't been... That we're, we have... Still need to finish. With our friends that we would be playing. Betrayal. House on the Hill. House right. on the Hill. Well, I do enjoy playing Kingdom Death. And I think you do, too. Okay, so let's show you who we're bringing out to this fight, and I'll uh, explain as best as I can uh, of what the spider... What we know. What of. we know of the spider. All right, so here is the Spideclis model. Uh, it's pretty unique because it really doesn't have a base. Uh, it's actual, it's shadow that forms underneath it is going to be um, its blind spot. It's, it takes up four spaces, and I do recommend to to put a two by two uh, base, which I'll have to get a hand, uh, my hands on unless we can easily see its shadow when we actually play. Um, so that's gonna be its blind spot. Uh, but you can move, it, it has movement 11. It can really move, I think, anywhere around the board. So I, I'm not really too sure how that's gonna work out with its AI cards. Uh, but what is unique about this as well is it has our introduction of our first, I guess we can call them minions. So there's these little spiderlings that, that spawn out. That's one of its special powers here. It says spawn. And we place a spiderling in an adjacent space. And at the end of the spider Cliss's turn, all the spiderlings are going to get an action. So they, they basically move up. I think they have uh, movement four. They have one attack for a level one, uh, hits on a four, and one damage. And they have one health each. We don't have to draw a hit location when we defeat them. So I wonder if it's worth it to go around and try and kill all the ads or let them overwhelm us and, uh -uh. and we die. So, yeah, let's see yeah. how that, that works. Uh, a level one spider Cliss has this mood in play. Um, basically, survivors cannot spend movement as long as one or more spy spiderlings are adjacent to them. And this is the most interesting thing, I think, is the Twitch Leg Pile. So it has minus one movement for each card under this pile. This is, I think, that special hit location where we start chopping off its legs. And if we have eight under here, at the end, when we defeat it, uh, we have this special event that comes into play. 
So we'll see if we can actually achieve that. So it will have 10 health, uh, 11 movement, 8 toughness. So, you know, just, just as strong as the line that we fought. But I, I don't know if he hits harder or whatnot. So There was only one lion, too, not baby lions. Huh? You know, the lion had, there was one. Right? Here oh, potential. yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, he's got a little, all these little, little babies coming at us. That's going to hurt us, too. Ah, let's see what happens. All right, so the characters that we're bringing out, I'm starting over here with Zelda. Uh, even though, look, I've, I finally have um, a rawhide leather armor suit that I wanted to just kind of paint up. But, of course, this is going to be a female character. Uh, only because Zelda's going to come out uh, with a full rawhide armor set. And she gets two... Uh, survival when she departs, and before she wouldn't have had any if I threw her on another uh, armor set, or non-armor set, that's why I had her go out with this, and she's just going to be going with the Founding Stone, so hopefully she can go out and be like our, our main tank in this fight. One thing I do want to point out, and why I do like to have our, our reviewers comment on this, uh, we totally forgot to use the correct organ grinder, which would have allowed us to build... Stone, Stone noses. noses? Yeah, yeah, that would definitely would help out in these fights because all the extra endeavors that we had. So Whoops. I think at the end of this fight, hopefully we can build some of those. Next is going to be Captain Falcon. He's coming out for the very first time with the skull cap hammer and the cat eye circlet. So we're going to try not to use the cat eye circlet so much and really just go for the attacks. I want, I want to switch it up a little bit. Uh, so let's see how that works. Wait, what? When are you going to tell me that? Okay, so I'm bringing out Samus. This will be her second time uh, coming out. She maxed up to Courage and got the Matchmaker ability last time. So she will be wearing our other almost full rawhide armor suit. The only piece we didn't make is the cloak because we didn't have enough. We wanted to make... The pants. The pants. I'm sorry. We didn't make the pants. What did I say? The I cloak. The cloak. I have no idea where that came from. We didn't make the waist armor. There okay, you go. there we go. Uh, we built the guitars instead. Okay, so that is Samus. And then last, we have to always bring Mario, because if you remember last time, he got that special ability rival scar with because Bowser. Bowser. Yeah, Bowser got taken from so, yeah, he got taken from us too early. So he's coming out. He gets plus two strength, but minus one evasion because of that. So he's at zero. Um, and he has the bone axe and just his waist cloth. So he'll be hopefully the furthest away with... Um, yeah, maybe he can go kill the little spiders. Yeah, that's fine with me. That's Absolutely. And uh, he got the fighting our vengeance. So if anybody dies in this fight, he gains four survival and a strength token. And that's really bad lighting. So I'm going to pull that up like that. Great. Good. You read the card already. Thank so. you. Okay. Here's the story of the spider. Can you read it over here? There's, there's no words over there. Oh, that's the picture. Here's the story over here. All good children know to hide when they hear the signs of the knocking ghost. A rapping outside your hovel, a laugh like dried leaves blowing over ground. The shadow of a familiar face disappearing around a corner. All bad children that dare go outside when it comes around will be snapped up. Never to be seen again. Let's go kill it. Okay. Right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm petrified. Because I feel like we're in the basement right now where all of the spiders in our house are currently. And I feel like the he's like dragging them unintentionally. Oh, he's got to chill. Yeah, toward Great. him. So nice. I'm going to keep my feet up okay. from the ground. Okay. They can climb. Here's the hunt board. Very menacing. Right? Um, especially since the first two events are spider events. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Uh -huh. Now, his space is really here. Four. Yeah. Okay. I just put it where his hands are, because that's when he first can grab us. Okay. All right? Mm-hmm. So, do you want... I'll start off down here, because that's what we usually do, right? It is, yes. Because so. I do not want to start that. 
Let's see what it is. Am I reading it? You are. Cave in is what it's called. Oh. Okay. The survivors descend into a silk-lined tunnel. As Hopefully they slowly we get silk. make their way, they feel the ground become thin beneath them. Suddenly the tunnel collapses and the survivors find themselves in a vast chamber. Any survivors wearing heavy gear are knocked unconscious. We can't wear heavy gear in this campaign. Nope, and suffer the concussion. Okay. If any survivors are not wearing heavy gear, nominate one among them with the highest courage. Oh, I think you have three, don't you? I do. It's Samus. Okay, to nominate roll Samus. on the Crystal Lake section of the Mineral Gathering Story event. Oh, wait, mineral gathering? Didn't I become like, didn't we, wasn't that the one where we tested and we went down and yeah. we rolled like really, and you have to roll like 10 the whole time or nines and tens the whole time? I don't know if that was the same one. Oh, mineral roll on gathering, the crystal lake, crystal lake section. All right. Roll it up. I roll one or two. Just one. One die. Yep. If you, do you have a whip? Do I have a whip? Negative. Okay. Roll high. Come on, Samus. Come on, Samus. Hey! Whoa, 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 whoa. This makes sense, right? Because Samus has the, the grappling hook whip thing. We should just get plus to the roll anyway. Just do it. Do it up. Come on. Five. Am I using my once in a lifetime reroll? Caked in slime and weird crystals, you find one iron. Strange resource. <gasps> oh, that's awesome. Right? That's pretty good. Yeah. That's a good, that's a good start. Because we know iron, we're going to Because I'm need. pretty sure that if I rolled a although, one, I would be dead. Although iron usually is for, for heavy stuff. Yeah, but can't you make other things with iron? Probably. Yeah. Like it's potions not heavy. or. Why am I shuffling the stream? I don't resources? know. Okay, so we're gonna move to the next one. Okay. Okay, this is Captain Falcon. It is called Cocoons. The survivors come across a large off white ball of silk. Deep Take within it. is the dark shadow of its contents. The survivors may nominate someone from among them with three plus courage to investigate. Do it up, Samus. Okay. I gotta roll high. I didn't look at any of them except the low one. Come on, Samus. Oh, no. Well, Samus. I gain a minus one speed token. Yep. Vapor seeps out of the broken silk burning your eyes. Minus one speed token. Minus one speed token. So it's only for this fight. Okay. Minus one attack with your Katars. Mm, let's see. Mm. You, you're going to have me oh, well. re-roll it? Oh, well. Re-roll? <laughs> Once in a lifetime re-roll because your eyes are burning? Just use some Visine and then you're set. So just, um, I think you have a negative over there. Oh, yeah. Speed. speed. Yeah, keep it there and... Because it's pointing to negative. Oh, and go here? Yeah, let's do that. Negative one. That makes sense. I was always pointing to negative. I probably shouldn't be. Yeah, I'm pointing to the negative two. It's zero luck. Strength. I'll change it up. All right. Okay, Next so one. now this is, is, this is Samus. Samus. This Jeez. is a random event. Random event. Just let's get through this one, Oops. and then we fight the spider. Oh gosh, 70. 70. Tomb of Excellence. The survivors find a serene, luxurious tomb, immaculate in its construction and condition. Elegant murals decorate the walls, depicting glorious victories over the very monster the survivors are hunting. I was going to say, we've never come across this event before. So the survivors are baffled because we've never been here before. Right. By its presence, the event revealer investigates. Oh, gosh. Roll a d10. <sighs> Come on, Samus. You found this mural. Roll something better than... The three. It's nice to see something pretty for once. A. Oh, 
I got a three again. A four. Okay, she was not supposed to roll high. That's it. That was pretty safe. That was a, and we now we fight the spider. And now I fight the spider. Okay, so do can we pull terrain? We can. So we have to we automatically start with some egg sacs and a silk nest. Okay, and what do they do? And then we need two random terrains. So we inter we can interact with both. The silk nest is impassable. It's an obstacle. Okay. So, legs everywhere, someone, plus one population. I guess I shouldn't be reading this. Yeah, one. I usually do that once, once it's all sorry. out. Okay, so I'm sorry, how many are we pulling? Two. Two. So what do we want? We want grasses. A dead monster would be nice. And grasses. Not two sculptures. What? What are salt sculptures? Salt. That's with the dragon god, I mean the lion god, they're in here. Oh. Pull something a little bit better. A lava pool? <laughs> we'll set it up. <laughs> Spider set up. We've got the nest in the center. We had to put the lava to the side. Basically, we just want to avoid the lava. Correct. You can jump over it if you want to try and gain some courage. I don't. Okay. Uh, we've got these salt statues. If you're in darkness, you get something from them. Oh. Yeah, salt. We don't get them. Right, but we're not in darkness, so they're kind of off to the side. And we have two eggs right here, which we can go and get silk from, but there might be a spider in spot. I don't even know if you could see those eggs on camera. The eggs are, well, oh yeah, they're so they're hidden back here because we have the yeah. giant spider in the way. I know, this is the biggest monster. Well, the phoenix is, what's that one over there? Uh, the dragon. Oh, well. That's the the phoenix is the biggest monster that I've have you fought. fought. Right. So we can see the shadow. It's underneath here. Mm -hmm. It takes up four spaces. They do recommend to use the base, uh, but still, I don't think you at home can even see if there's a base there or not. So yeah. it's underneath the spider. And let us know if, you know, I, I want to have the spider on the board because... Yeah. Oh, well, we have to because it has a shadow rather than just having the space around. So we're going to have this. We're going to have it. We have to set up at this top line right up here. Um, he's got 10 health. It doesn't say that he starts facing us, which is weird. So I'm going to have him facing. Yeah, we don't want him to see us coming. Yeah, that's right. But he does have the first turn. Right, he does have 10 health. And we're going to play a few rounds before we take a break today. But we want to see what this fight's, what this fight's going to be like. I'm so nervous. Uh... Did you shuffle both decks? I didn't shuffle. You uh, know we shuffle, shuffle the hit on location. camera. location. I don't so know what the trap is in that. Oh gosh. There's only one though, right? Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure. So we that. have dodging and in embolden, remember? There could be eight traps. Eight traps. All right. There's eight legs. Spider goes first. Oh gosh. Ready for this? Fling. Pick for a this target. threat. Facing in range. Okay, well, right. no one's facing. Oh. Okay. Okay. Furthest survivor in field of view. Great. So we put our two tanks, tanks in the middle as the closest. And so it's either going to be um, Captain Falcon. Captain Falcon or Mario. Mario. Okay, let's see. Fling. Furthest survivor in field of view. Perform spawn. But we're not in oh, the wait, field wait. of view. Oh. We're not in the field of view. I don't have the uh, monster controller token. And we're not in the field of view. All right, so I'm just going to use this until we find it. Okay. Okay. Uh, pick target. First is start facing for the survivor field of view. Okay. Perform spawn, but place the spiderling on an unoccupied space adjacent to the target. If possible, place the spiderling between the target and spiderclis. Full move spiderclis away from all threats. Then turn to face the most survivors. Wow. wow. Okay, so. I have no idea what luck, you just said. Well, luckily, he doesn't really do much. Basically, he just throws a spiderling. He flings a spiderling. At the closest, or the, the furthest. farthest threat. So either it can go after Captain Falcon. Well, you want, let's or, roll. Or Mario. One to five. Well, we get, we get, we can, we can pick. Oh, okay, well. I don't think, so we have to, I think it's random because I'm going to pick your character and you're going to pick mine. Oh, well, good thing I'm the monster controller 
And I'm uh, going to put them towards you. Great. Mario with two strength. Okay. Yeah. Mario with two strength to kill this thing. Okay. All right. Uh, throwing over to Mario. And then full move the Spiraclus away from all threats. It's movement's 11. So he's going to be going down to the corner, probably off camera. Well, he's probably never going to be off camera. So well, let's his see. legs One, are two, still always going to be. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. I see, I see the four spaces. He turns you around. You want the base to... Nope, I got it. Look at that. Bam. Oh, I see okay. the four. He's, he's hiding down here now. He turns around and faces. Yep. Got it. Yep. We can see the shadows. Yes. Yeah, now he's really far away. In or no? So, oh yeah, you can't even see. Yeah, you can't. You can't okay. see. So, the end of the turn. His turn now. The spiderling attacks. I guess this gives us a chance to to move up and deal with these eggs this turn. Sure. All right, but he's really far. I didn't think he would. Do yeah, that. no. All right, so now the spiderling's going to attack. Uh, closest threat in range. So this is you. One speed. Accuracy four. Mario, do you have that evasion or did you lose your evasion? If you lost evasion, I'm going to have the spider link come after me. I instead. lost my evasion. All right, I guess it makes sense to have it come after me instead. Okay, rerun. Okay. Here you go. As soon as the cat. You're the monster controller. All right, so it's actually attacking Captain Falcon. Okay. So he hits on a five. Ugh. So this is one point of damage to the legs. So that is a light injury. Already, from the spider. Line. Okay. I know. I know. We have a spider underneath the already, table. Already, already starting. I know. As soon as we start taping, she wants attention. So it's our turn. Good. Knock him out. Cold. So I'll attack this spider. Well, what's your weapon? Uh, the skull cap hammer. Okay. It hits on a seven. Can you get it behind him? Is there any behind? I can't move because I'm adjacent oh, to. Oh right. Oh, well then can someone else do it for you? Sure. Yeah. Yeah. He has no facings. Um, okay, so one, two, three, four, five. So I can move there. What do you mean he has no facings? And he has no blind spot or anything, so it doesn't matter. Oh. Well, that's the whole point. That it doesn't matter. All right, I'll attack. Well, I can... I no, can that's okay. I'll get it started. I'll I get it started with my hammer. I hit on sevens, hitting the spider. Two hits. Two hits. He has no hit locations, so now I just have to roll to see if I wound. Okay. Uh, the strength of the skull cat camera is skull cat camera is three. I have four strength, uh, and the toughness of the spider is equal to the monster, so it's an eight. Eight. So I need a four or more to squish the spider. One at a time. What are you doing? What am I doing? I would have liked to have rolled both of them because there's no there's no penalty. Oh. So if I just did this, he would have died. Okay. Well, um, she can come over. Oh, yeah, she better. Zelda? Okay. I mean, this is Samus. One, two, three. Okay. Okay, yeah, you, that's you fine. You want her there? No, you can go there. That's fine. You want me to go behind? So you can get closer to the spider. Okay, well, I have to turn this way. Okay. So she has the Katars, mm -hmm. but she just got... Minus one speed token. Minus one speed. Whoops. So she only rolls one dice. Correct? Yep. Okay. So she hits on a seven. Yep. Do I have any? Can I make, can I make some suggestions? Sure, absolutely. Rather than having the person that only attacks once, you know, why doesn't she go and activate... A, a trap card? Yeah, activate the trap cards. Okay, well then why did you... Okay, one, two, three, four, five. Sure. So this is a nest. Activate that nest. What do I got to do? You just roll a d10. Six. The egg sack explodes. Gain one web silk strange resource. I'll take it. Oh, and replace the terrain tile with the spiderling. You have attracted unwanted attention to yourself. Gain the priority target token. Which I don't have either. Okay, so how about I use this? The base is the priority target. Okay. Monster's going to come after you, which is fine. We want the monster well, to come yeah, after I you. Well, yeah, I have armor. 
And we gain our first silk, which now that I shuffled in here, it's going to be amazing. We can start building the silk armor. But we probably need the location to build the silk armor first, right? Web silk. Here it is. Great. So we get our first web. Right. It is made of silk. It's impossible to tear. Wow. Try as you might. Okay. All right. Um, Bone axe. Let's go attack these things. Okay. Yep. Okay. Bone axe is two speed. Mm -hmm. I've got z two strength. Every time we play, two speed. So I've got happens. two strength and no accuracy. So um, I hit on sixes. Mm hmm. Yep. Let's start. I hit on sixes. Let's start with that. Okay. Hit on sixes. Here I like, we go. I like it. I like it. That's a reroll. No, it's not. I'm pretty sure it is. I'm trying to cheat. Oh, okay. You're. On fire. All right, let's 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 go down here. Um, I'm going to go like this. Uh, I've got my founding stone, two acts. It's on sevens. One hit. Doesn't wound. Oh my gosh, we are off to an amazing start. Spiders all Every around year. us. All right, that's a new round. Oh boy. I'm the priority. Ooh. Hydraulic Leap. It's a duration card. When this is drawn face down, remove Spider Cliss from the showdown board. Oh, was he going to be like that one that disappears and then comes back? Looks like it. All survivors suffer one brain damage. What now? Okay, so that's a light injury here, light injury here. Me, I had one over here, so... Oh, I had one for each of them. I had one. Oh, so Insanity. How many times are we going to do that? A lot. We don't really have to look at the board. I know, I know. I just want to double check it in case I did it wrong. Okay, so mine are both zeros. While hydride, Hydraulic Leap is drawn face up, pick target random survivor. Okay, so next turn it's going to come down at us. We can't dodge the attack. It's one attack, hits on two, three damage. Aye. After... We take damage, we suffer bash and knockback five. So, so I don't get we, I don't get the whole pick up. So it's just like this. Oh, it goes so on next top time of the deck, right? So next time we happen. just draw a face up. So we have a turn to fight these spiderlings. But now they actually attack us. Okay. Mm -hmm. So um, they are closest threat in range, so we can pick, so I'll have it actually pick Zelda. Zelda over here. So Zelda has, let's see, um, it's on four, five evasion, six evasion because the rawhide vest. Miss. And over here on you, same thing, six to hit because you have one evasion and you've got the rawhide vest going. Okay. Miss. All right. Got it. Okay. Whee! Let's try to... Let's try to fix this. Okay, bone axe. Mario. Start it. He's going on this guy right here. Okay, that's another reroll on the same piece of terrain that you missed, you rolled on last time. That's a hit. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh. If you critically wound, nope. Okay, so you only need a three to wound. Here. I need a three to wound. Got it. Get rid of this spider lane. Get it off the board. Critical. Cause an additional wound. Good. You really sliced that spider in half. <laughs> I rolled two critical. Now, do you want to move? I could. Well, I don't want to be closest to anywhere. Well, it's random. It's random? Of who he comes out at. Well, then do you want me to move over to this guy? Maybe just to get there. Oops. Whoa. Whoa. One, two, three, four. Good? Sure. Where do you want me to move? Uh, honestly, the closest, because yeah. if he lands here on you, then at least we might be able to get there. Uh, but if you're like, oh, let me go all the way to the other side. It's a good thing you're here. It's a good thing you're here. Okay. I'm going to attack here. Okay. 
with, um, with Captain Falcon. One hit. hit. Kill. Three strength. Yep. Dead. Then I'm going to move closer. One, two, three, four, five. Now, what I could do with Zelda is I can use the Rawhide Headband to look at Hydraulic Leap and the next card, and I can decide which one to put on top. I like it. Right? Yes. Place them back on top of the deck in any order. So I'm going to do that as my action. So let's see what the other one is. It is Arachnophobia. Perform Spawn. Full move the monster towards the center of the showdown board. Hmm, I wonder if I can actually do this. Because you have to do the other first to place them back on the board. Yeah, that's a good question. Because I would just have it go through the whole deck like this. Full move the monster towards the center of the showdown board. Well, I, you know what? I'm going to put... I'm not sure is the answer. Okay. We might not be able to... Rawhide. Headband with the Doration card on top. Do you want to check Maybe it? Maybe you can put it down here, and then I would do this, because then it would spawn... Yeah, but then what? It spawns in the middle of the board? Full move the monster. No, that's spawning uh, little spiderlings. Oh. Well, yeah, we would spawn a spiderling there. Full move the monster towards the center of the showdown board. See, that wouldn't happen. Imitate all survivors, suffer one brain. Wait down. a minute. I didn't go yet. I, I know. I'm raw high. Oh, you're right. Oh, my gosh. I'm sorry. We're not going to be playing much longer because it's late and... <laughs> Obviously. It's just... I have no idea what's going on. We're just going to use the hydraulic leap. We're going to keep it on top. Okay, so you're not headbanding. No. I just had. Oh, you just had banded. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, Samus still has to go. Well, can I move? Yep, you absolutely can move. Yes, thank you. One, two, three, four. Does Is priority target out? stay on me? Uh, no. It was for that round. round. Yes. Okay. Okay, should I go over to the spider? I think. What do you mean? You're looking to see if it stays on me? Sorry, everybody. I'm tired. We're in a heat wave here in the Northeast. I'm just, I'm just not having a good day. As you can see, I... I had the priority target token nearby, and it would actually say when it goes away. I don't know if the spiderlings actually cause it to go away. You had the priority target token nearby. That's the monster controller, but we also needed that one too. Thank you, you threw it on the ground. just gonna stop and we'll come back well rested With a little bit cooler rules. and all the rules you're so bad right now it's right here it's right here oh, okay so then it's right it's here right here forget it okay here we go priority monster target. controller bang i can get rid of this die priority target when a monster performs a pick target action it targets you a monster so are not yet. Spiderlings considered monsters. I think they are. Um. Well, is there a spiderling card? I think it just goes away at the end of the round. Okay. Uh, did you want to move? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I was doing. One, two, three, four. Is that okay there? Should I move? Well, he's going to land. And you're going to suffer bash and knock back five. Who? Both of us. Wh whoever he hits. So how about we go like this. So when he lands, he's going to hit us, one, one of us that way. Okay, that's fine. All right? Okay. So I don't do anything. That's the end of the round. Got it. I lose my priority target. I'm pretty sure. Yep. Okay. Yep. 
Next round, right? The di Oh, this. I'm yeah. going to move this over here. Thank you. The monster is going to come down, and there's no spiders here, so we are actually going to be able to attack this thing. That's really what I want to try and do. Get one okay. round of attacks in. Okay. Hydraulic leap. So uh, you randomize two, uh, two, four, six, eight. Who he comes down and attacks? Two, four, he six, attacks five, six. One, Samus. two, three, four, five, six. That's good. Because you have armor. I do. So he comes down like this. And I have survival. But you can't dodge this. I can't? Why? Well, because that's that's what it said. Oh. Yep. I thought it was only this. This attack cannot legs. dodge. Oh. Alright, so lands on you. Uh, speed one. So one attack. Accuracy two. You have three evasion here, four evasion because you're a great person. Mm -hmm. All right. So it hits a, on a four. This would be great if we got a miss going. Yeah, it, it right, right here. here. Miss. That was such a nice light drop. I felt like, you know, it will, yeah. spiders is very like. Yeah. Because this would have hurt. Three damage. Uh, miss. But guess what? That's his turn. This is what I've been waiting for. Time to chop down the spider. So we go underneath him? That's its blind spot. You get plus one accuracy. So you're under there now. I am? This is you, right? It's you right here. Yeah. You're in its blind spot. Okay. Oh, because the shadow's this mm -hmm. way now. You see the four spots? I do, yes. Yeah. I do. Thank you, yes. Okay. So I'm going to attack it with one attack. My guitar. Unfortunately. Oh yeah, you only get one attack. Yeah. So I hit on a six. Yep. Because I'm in his blind spot. Come on. Come on. Do it, Samus. Come on. Sam. Ch chop this up. Seven. Hit. Alright, great. Our first hit location. What okay. do we got? Okay. Cunning four legs. Okay, let's see what happens. Oh my gosh. So there's a failure and there's a wound reaction. Oh so boy. You have plus one strength, that's right? I have plus one luck with this weapon too. Okay, great. Uh, you have, there's no there's no crit on this. Oh, okay, great. Yes, I have plus one, one plus strength. One strength. This is three. Yes. So that's four. four. So you need a four to wound this thing. Okay. Four to wound. Start it up. Four to wound. Let's do it. Let's take one of these legs off. Nine. Nine. So that would have been a crit, but there's no crit on here. Wound. The reaction cannot be canceled. You hack off one of the Spyroclus's legs. It twitches on the ground. Okay. Place this card under the twitching leg card pile. So that is one leg down. And he takes a wound? Yep. Nine. Excellent. Okay. Now I can move if you want me to. Um, if you want, you're in the blind spot right now. So I should just you have the Well, because you have the armor, armor. maybe you back up one. Uh, how is that going to work? Over here? You can stand on its fingers and everything. Oh, I can? Yep. Okay, so you're, you know, we could just do this. So you're here. Okay. You're in that spot? Got it. Okay. Got it. Let's see how else we do with our attacks. I don't know if I'm on a raw head headband or okay. just go in. So So should Mario, Mario could go one, two, three, yeah, four. Yeah, 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 yeah. I like it. One, two, three, four. No one can see what's going on under this. Okay. He gets two attacks. He hits on fives, because we're in the blind spot. Yes. Hits on fives. With the bone axe. With the bone axe. One, One hit. hit. The segment trochanter? I have no idea what that is. I don't know. Maybe it's like the body part? Maybe. Okay. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. No, I need to wound. Three. Three to wound. Two strength. Four, five. I have two strength. So uh, I need a three? Yes. Come on. Six. Six. I don't know. How, how you feel I don't know that? how. Yeah. All right. Well, that's a wound. I threw it through the spider. The spider cliss extends its legs, lifting its body high into the air. End all melee attacks not made with spears. Okay. Perform spawn, then full move all spiderlings towards the attacker. All right. So spiderling comes out here uh -huh. and moves next to you. Okay. But you wounded him. I did. I did. Okay. 
So we did that. It wasn't great because we didn't get the legs, but that's okay. Okay. It's one minus one movement though, but it's gonna be tough to actually hack off all its legs because he has ten wounds. Well, minus one move isn't really that no, fabulous right. right now. All right, so um, I have my hammer and my founding stone. So I ca here's the thing: Do you kill the spider or do you kill the spiderling? Right. Well, do we know the answer? If the spider dies, do all the spiderlings die instantly? I don't, but I'm pretty sure we just have to kill the spider. Okay, then attack the spider. Wow. I would have actually gone up to the spiderling. Oh, really? Well, you yeah. have two characters. The other one could do the spiderling. Well, I, the other one was going to do the headband, so we know we, oh. can, we can control the attack. Okay, then I say do the spider. I'm gonna do the spider okay. with the go because now we're in the, we're close to the blind spot. Oh, uh, oh no! Oh yeah, one, two, three. Oh, one, two, three, four, five. I can go through its leg, come up over here. So I'm in its blind spot with a skull head hammer. Two attacks, uh, hit on sixes. Excellent. One hit. One hit. Oh, segmented sturum. Now it's a super dense location, so if you actually hit this with your axe. It would have broke. broke, yep. Yeah. All right. So I have three strength from this, four strength, four. I need a four to wound. Come on, do it, do it, do it. Oh, yeah. Did you see that critical? I it was quickly, almost a critical. Quickly. On a perfect hit. I didn't perfect hit. Okay. Uh, the spider cliff plunges to the ground with surprising speed. All survivors adjacent to the monster, including those in its blind oh, spot, no. suffer bash and knockback five. So we're all... That's okay. scary. That's scary. Okay, well, I did wound to it. Okay, okay. seven. Now, suffer bash and knockback five. So you're adjacent. One, two, three, four. You fall down. One, two, three, four. I fall here. Um, and then... So you don't get to draw? Drivers them? cannot spin... Oh, and then you... I think you fall down right here, because you get knocked that way. Oh. Into the spider. Why? Actually, I think you go that way. Into over the, the lava? Oh, over the lava. You get knocked by... The survivor moves through, or ends the room, they suffer one damage, and return all their flammable gear. Do you have anything flammable? No. I don't. Mm -mm. I just I don't know which way you would fly, either that way or that way. Um, well, why don't I fly the same way everybody else did? Well, because of the four spaces. I'm in th the way that the you're standing right now. Yes. You wouldn't go the same way as everybody else. You're kind of like going out from. Oh, okay. You know, because this person was in the front. They're gonna go that way. This person was adjacent. They go that way. You're kind of okay. In well, back what about corner. your guy? Well, I'm not adjacent to him. You're not he adjacent. only is these four spaces right here. Oh. Should I use this? Oh, oh, oh. No, no, no. Now right? I get it. Now I get. It. See, I'm thinking the fingers confuse me because it's like, well, you're totally adjacent, but you're not. Right. Okay. So I think what's actually worse is that you get knocked back. Over Into the, the lava, yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah. Is the nest, um... Oh, the nest is impassable, actually. Oh, so you can't even go that way. So I have to go the other way? So you're just going to stay right here. You get knocked down. Okay. <laughs> After okay, so all that. Now it's your turn. Okay. So I think I'm going to... I'm the only one standing. I wish we could shout. So I'm the only one... I'm the only threat right now. So if I'm the only threat... Um, I don't really care what the cards are. Okay. I'm just going to move up and, well, I attack this thing with the Founding Stone. It's strength one. Yeah, all of our other weapons are the ones that can wound really well. Yeah. So you want to go attack the spider? Same thing. I would, I oh. would still need a oh, six yeah. to wound. So let's... I'm going to go up and attack it. The spider Ling or oh, the spider? Now I'm going to be in the blind spot. Oh, so that means I will I will stand my ground 
okay. and headband to play it safe. Because I want to make sure that I'm the person. Okay, look, there's two moods right here. When this comes into play, discard all their moods and perform basic action. While this is in place, Spiderling's action profile gains after damage. Full move the Spiderling directly away from... Okay, suffers grab. So this would allow Spiderlings... To pull us. To attack and pull. Okay. Right? And grab means they, you're going to suffer one damage. Okay. Or the other mood, because these are both advanced cards. Caustic Pheromones. Uh, discard all their moves and perform basic action. While this is in play, all Spiderlings attack after damage. Target gains priority target token. Okay. So we're going to do that. Caustic pheromones and not yeah. feeding time. Got it. Yep. Yep. Yeah. Because there's only one spiderling. And then we'll be able to determine who the priority target token is. Okay. Okay. I think that's good. Uh, so then I'm going to... Let's see what its basic action is. Basic action is closest threat facing in range. Okay. So it's you. Yep. That's okay. what we want. So I will, um, I'll move up one. That's it. So end of the round. Let's go one more. Okay. Monster's turn. He's going to draw this AI card. And he's so gonna he's going to discard all other moves. moves in play. Now I wonder... What about that mood? Yeah, I actually think that that gets discarded. The frantic spinning. Now that's going to be basically another health that gets back. So usually when a mood comes into play, you're going to lose, lose a health. One. But now he's actually gaining a health. So this comes back. Now caustic pheromones are in play. And then the spider is going to do basic action on Zelda. Okay. It's okay. speed one. It's speed two. Okay. It's on two, three... Four. Two attacks hitting on fours. Both hit. Maybe you want to dodge? Well, let's see where he hits me. It's only one damage apiece. Waste a waste and, and a head. So I will take the waste damage. And I have... Oh, maybe Embolden would be good here. I'm going to dodge the... Headshot. Okay. Uh, because I have the rawhide set, I get my survival back. Nice. So that's good. Now the spiderling goes. Closest threat in range. So again, that's going to be on me. Oh. Goes right here. Okay. And uh, attacks me. This hits on a four, five, six. Low. Miss. Miss. And I gain... Oh, no, after damage, I would have gained the priority target token. Okay. But I didn't. Okay. So that's the end of the round. Okay. So we all stand up. Well, that's the end of the monster's turn. Yeah. So, yep, you stand up right underneath it. Okay. Um, no, I'm going to go. Yeah. yeah. Attack this thing. Yeah. Right? You're, right, you're still under Bone there. Axe. Bone axe. Bone axe Two thing. attacks hitting on fives. Okay, those are complete misses. Complete misses. So I should move. Stay there. Yeah, you're in, I guess, well, I don't know. I don't know. I'll stay. Okay. I'm going to move up. One, two, three, four. I'll go all the way down here. We will have to get this eventually because the silk, but we don't have to do it right now. Uh, blind spot with the hammer, hitting on sixes. Oh, you okay. didn't do much better either. I did not. I didn't do any better. Okay, are you going to try to kill this guy? Or should I come and kill the little guy? You only have one attack, right? Five. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to oh, leave wait, it up to Oh, wait, I you. can't. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I can mm -hmm. So what am I hitting on? I'm hitting on a wow. seven. That's a real shame. No one can see what's going on because of the spider. I'm right here. <laughs> on his hand. Hmm. I wonder if maybe we shot the camera like this. 
over our shoulders, shoulders. might be able to see it. Well, let's finish this round up, and maybe that's something we'll that we'll do. We'll switch it up. Okay. Yeah. So one attack hitting on a seven. I don't like these odds. No, Should I do something else? The only other thing that you could do is go under it and try to hit on a six on the actual spider. Did someone headband? I have not headbanded yet. Are you going to? I don't know. Because I have a headband. Oh. Oh. Well, then you stay back. Let me go in. I'm going to go attack the spider. Okay. Right? Because right now, I don't You're mind close. I don't mind the spiderling attacks me. Okay. Because I'll gain the priority target token. Okay. So I'm going to go underneath the spider. I'm going to attack. I need sixes to hit because I'm underneath. One, One hit. hit. Excellent. That's a... Troach hammer again. Segmented troach hammer. Uh, one, two... Troach so I wound on a six. Oh, another critical that I almost missed on. Ah, wouldn't have mattered. So nothing happens. So you can go in for the one attack or raw hide it. Let's do a headband. All right, so we got another mood. Um, we knew that. Oh yeah, this, this is the grab, is a grab one. one. This is a grab one. Okay, closest the threat facing in range. Birthing hour. Great, it's not me. Oh, okay. Full move forward, then turn to face the most survivors and place this card on top. I would do the birthing hour because okay. right now it would be coming after you. Okay. And you are our tank. Right. Oh, One you know, them. a little bit. Uh, he is going to spawn somebody afterwards. Okay. That's going to me. Or, we do feeding time. Uh-huh. He performs basic, basic action, action. On who? Which is still you. Okay. And then who gets grabbed? Uh, I would only get grabbed if he hits me. Which I can dodge. So mm -hmm. maybe we do mood. Because that's one okay. less spawn that's going to come into play. Okay. I like it. And you can move, right? Yes. I'll move a little bit closer. Because he's going to walk up to you, so keep him so... Yeah. I like it. And then let's stop there. And then next time, let's set the camera up maybe okay. like this to see right. everyone can see what's going on. Okay, excellent. Got some rest. We got a lot of rest. The, the last time we you saw us playing a few seconds ago... Uh, was actually a few days ago. We were out of it. I was. I was. I'm always out of I it. I remember it. I was frustrated. I was trying to look things up. Just was the, having... the camera angle. We were worried you guys couldn't see the spider and all the characters and where they were positioned. Um, we took some time. We set up the camera from the side angle now. Something different. You might be able to now have a clearer view. Um, it's just. It's hot down here. That's the only. I'm not that hot. Okay. Alright. Fine. Totally so, fine. I think we are in our fourth round, right? Sure. Who is that character? That's there? Mario. Mario is monster controller. Mm-hmm. Um, and the monster goes first. Sure. Right? I, I don't even so, yes. I don't remember if we did headband or anything. Um we I think we did, because that's why she's back here. Got it. Well let's see. Let's see if we did it right. I don't remember. And we completely forgot. Feeding time. It's a mood. When this comes into play, yeah. start all other moods and perform basic action. You right, pick right, that. Right, right. So this mood comes back out. Feeding time. What comes happens in. with the the um, dice? What do you mean? What oh, happens with the dice? Do we have to add a wound or take away a wound? No, because it's the same. Okay. Can can the camera see I, that? Probably? I already set that up properly. See, I'm touching it. See it? Seven. I don't know if you can see. I'm pretty sure okay. people can see that. Okay. Uh, so perform basic action. Basic closest threat facing. Uh, so it's right here. Oh. Oh, because you know what? Now it's really tough. It's you. Because it's really tough. There's no um shadow. I don't really see the shadow. Do you? Well, the shadow should be these four. It's, it's the. Yeah, I'm. One, two, three, four. Him. Hmm. Oh, I see the shadow now. Oh, so yeah, it's her. Oh, now I got the shadow. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so he's in the shadow. Let's put this down for people. Yeah, but then our guys are going to oh, okay, be able to right. Yeah, okay, you got it, it. you got okay. it, you got it. You can pull his these hands four, off. These four. 
pull his hands off. Yeah, so because right now there's not anything. enough height. Oh, it's I glued. Break anything? Oh, okay. Yeah, they're not attached with scotch tape. Okay. Okay, you were using right. that gummy stuff last campaign. Closest threat facing. Right here. That's you, right? That is Samus. Okay. Move and attack. So, moves up. Okay, now remember, she's got two survival, and she's wearing um, almost all of the rawhide gear. Speed two. On the monster controller. Hits on two. One evasion. Hits on threes. Rawhide vest. Hits on fours. Two attacks? Two attacks hitting on fours. On Samus. One hit. One hit. To the body. So one damage. I will take that hit. That's right. Um, so now I'm down to zero. Okay. Okay. Got it. Uh, so that's it. Spider's turn's done. But now it's the little swarms. And let's see. While this is in place, Spiderling's actions attack profile gains after damage. Oh, this is when they grab. This is when they grab. But only if they do damage? Only if they, yep, only if they do damage. Uh, so let's see. They are going to go here. Closest is over here, Zelda. I got the full armor over here. Mm -hmm. So again, hits on fours. One attack hitting on fours. Watch this. Watch this. Dodge. You hit, hit. me. I'm just going to spend a survival to dodge it because I do not want to get grabbed. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm looking to see if you could actually see what the dice was. It was a four. Okay, now I it's failed. a three. So I spent my survival. I didn't get it back, but that's it. Okay. I don't. I dodged out of the way. You don't get hit, and we stay in position. Right. Okay. Our turn. Mm hmm. Get to attack this thing. So only here. I am gonna put this now that people can actually see what's going on. That's the blind spot. Because I had to move up. The spider moved up? Yeah, in order to attack. Oh, okay, so we're not all in the blind spot now. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so fighting this spiderling would be pretty good to get rid of it. Um, Wait, can I attack diagonal? No. Okay. You're new to this game? No, I just, uh, for a second I was confused with Mandara. Or do we even bother with the spiderling? We still want to get this, right? But we don't have to do that kind of to the end. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep, seven. Seven wounds. Okay. So you tell me. I'm going to leave it up to you. No, 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 no. We're oh, not starting off this day with this. We're not starting off this day with this. Well, I'm feeling pretty good. All right, then I will... Okay, uh, so you're going to move here and attack. Boom. Because this is Mario. Uh-huh. This is Zelda. This is your other character. Captain Falcon. Captain, right, Falcon. Captain Falcon's going to move underneath into the blind spot. Mm -hmm. And attack and the spider. Yep, because I got this giant hammer. I would like to hit with this. So I hit on sixes. Two attacks. You have minus one speed, right? With the guitar. So I'm just trying to remember. From I do, that. because right. of something in hit the on front. sixes. Two hits with the skull cap hammer. Okay, I thought, okay, it, I I thought, thought it, it was a trap. a trap for a second. All right, so now the cards are a little off over here. So let's see, this is the tricky four legs. If I wound this, this reaction cannot be canceled. You hack off one of the spiderling's legs, it twitches on the ground. Place this card, okay. Oh yeah, so we want that. So I'm gonna do that one first. The tricky four legs. Because the other one has a reflex action. Mm -hmm. All right, so strength of the hammer is three. I have plus one strength, four. Toughness, I think, on this thing is eight. Eight. Yep. It's like the lion, I think. Yep, so I need a four to knock off one of its legs. Yes, Boom. knocked five. Five. All right, so this goes underneath here. So we've cut off two legs so far. That is a wound. Six. Six. Uh, on right. a perfect hit. I haven't done a perfect hit. Uh, and now my other attack is the segmented abdomen. If you hit with a spear... No, I didn't. I didn't. It's Gain plus two strength. Reflex. That's another wound. Okay, reflex. I don't like this. Okay, I'm aware. Full move the Spidecles away from all threats. Cancel all hits now out of range. Full move all Spiderlings toward the attacker. Okay, that's not that bad. So it has uh, 11 movement minus 2 has 9 movement. So 
Let's go. Whoa, one, whoa, two, whoa. How did three, that get down four, to a four? Five, six, seven, eight, nine. I mean, how did it get down to four? I just did two. Oh, I did two wounds. It to needs it, right? to go to a five. Yeah. So this is now the spider. Cheater. Like so. Okay. Oh, it goes down to a five. And then full move. And spiraling toward towards the, the attacker. attacker. All right. There you go. Okay. Okay, this goes uh, here. That was nothing. Right? Yeah. Okay. I'm done here. Well, now none of us can get to attack it. One, two. Yeah, because of the lava pit. One, two, three, four, five. No. Well, definitely, let's say, kill the spiderling and maybe do the nest. And one of us could headband. Yep. So I'll save myself for headbanding. Oh, you're going to oh. save yourself. Sure. Zelda. So you attack the spiderling. Okay, so I have to move. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Is that okay if I move there? That's One, perfect. two, three, four. Yeah, attack that. Um, he attacks with his bone axe. Two attacks hitting on uh, sixes because there's no blind spot. Right. And you don't have any extra accuracy. I do not have any extra accuracy. Okay. All right. No, double misses. Okay. Um, she's going to have to attack. Or do the cocoon. She could, it's up to you. Well, what do we have to do for the cocoon? Because you can move away now. Because that was the other card where you couldn't move away from spiderlings. This one you can freely move. What do I have to do for the cocoon? Roll one? One die? Um, yeah, you roll a die. You automatically get the silk, but then something I like get. Happen. It could get injured? Yeah. One, two, three, four. Okay. Eight uh, seconds. One die. Nine. Oh, that's good. Get another web silk. Thank you. So that's two. That's, I think, our entire goal for fighting the spider. Okay. And a nine. The spiderling that emerges is a deformed mess that dies in seconds. Remove it from the showdown board and gain two insanity. Oh. So it didn't even spawn another spiderling. Excellent. Insanity is this. Yep. Boop, boop. No, it goes like this. Boop, boop. Yep, just okay. some booping. Okay. All right, so now I just have a headband. Um, let's see, we know what all the things are. Oh, it's got to get shuffled up. Um, yeah, and I'm just going to headband. That's okay. my action. Let's see what's coming out. Fling and hydraulic leap. Fling for the threat facing... Uh, perform spawn full move spider away from all threats. I don't want that to happen. While this card is drawn face up, remove spiraling from the showdown board. Uh, then it's going to come down and attack somebody for three damage. That I don't really want. Yeah, because we suffer brain damage, right? And I don't have any insanity over here. No brain damage, but it's just three damage. Yeah, all survivors suffer X brain damage. Oh, okay. Okay, you're right. So I'm going to keep fling on top. Okay, so who's it gonna go to? It doesn't. He, uh, he's gonna For this? spawn. But place the spiderling on an occupied space adjacent to the to the target. Furthest threat facing in range. So he doesn't attack me. I just get a spiderling. Yep. Near me. Yep. Okay. And then he runs away. We're, oh. still, we're gonna do that. Okay. Um, I could actually move to be the furthest threat if you like. That makes sense. Uh. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Now I'm the furthest threat. So the spiderling will come after me. The furthest threat from who? From the spider. Oh. The monster that we're fighting. I thought, well, maybe it was the nest. I forgot. Okay. No, it's not. Okay. Good? Good. End of the round? Yes. Switches down here. Monster's turn. Fling. Furthest threat facing. Perform slum, place the spiderling on an occupied space adjacent to the target, possible place please between the target and the spider. Bang. Like so. Okay. Full move the spiderling away from all threats, then turn to face the most survivors. So he moves that way. Okay. So One, we're two, just gonna three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. He's way off the board. And way off camera. And way off camera. Look, uh, he's, he's in the look, you can see his feet. Yeah, I know. It's helpful. 
Okay, so we're uh, just gonna attack these spiderlings. And that's it, now the spiderlings attack. So let's start with that one over there on me. Oh, okay. So it's one attack, right? Hitting yes. on a four. Miss. Miss. And then this one, uh, closest threat, so it can either hit here or there. Do you have any damage over there? Do I have any damage? I have a light. I'll put them on myself. I'll put them no, on no, myself. I, I, I don't have any he damage. Me. He hit me. You couldn't In the me. hand. It's just light. It's just light. Okay. It's just a light injury. That's it. Okay. Okay, it's our turn. How do we get down there? We're going to probably have to headband because we know that the other thing is Why don't coming. we headband first? And then we'll see which card brings right. him toward us. It's going to be one of the moods, so we're going to do this. Yeah. When this comes to play, discard all of the moods and perform basic action. Okay, well, what's basic action? He's just going to move nine spaces towards us and attack. No target spin. Closest start facing in range. Closest survivor in field of view. Okay, yeah, so he's just going to move and attack. He's going to move nine spaces. Okay, so let's plan who's going to gonna be the person he's attacking. Well, I don't think he's going to reach us. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. He's getting here. Oh, so if we stand where we are, nobody's getting attacked. Right, so we might want to just move to get closer. Okay. So, so then we can do something to him. Okay. That's it, he'll just move. Okay, so we got to kill these guys and then move over. Yep. Okay, so Mario could attack. I'm still going to move now. Oh. One, two, three, four, five. Because I still can. Okay, Mario's going to attack this guy. All right, do it up with his bone axes. Two attacks hitting on... This is not a Kingdom Death die. Yes, it is. Two attacks hitting on sixes with the bone axe. Come on. There you go. Mm, once per attack, if you critically wound... No. Nope. Nope. Okay. All right, so now you have to wound, so you need fours to wound. Okay, so you can I... roll both of them. doesn't matter. Okay. There's no hit locations or anything on the spider. Fours to wound. Dead. If you critically wound... <clears throat> doesn't matter. That's exactly what I rolled last time. Seven and ten. Okay. Seven and ten. Congratulations. Okay, excellent. So he's going to move. Okay. One, two, three... Four, but I can't be closer than him. No, well, it doesn't matter. Fine, One, two, three, four, five. Yep. Okay. Um, who's gonna get that one? My chick. Yeah. Sure. Yeah, because I can't get over there. One, two, three, four. Do it with your one attack guitar. What am I hitting on? Seven. I'm hitting on sevens. Oh, that was silly. Oh, do you have minus one accuracy actually? You hit it on eights. So, so it would be like, token. it should be like this. Oh, no, because it's a minus one accuracy token. Yeah. Hit it on so then eight. should I just go over there? Okay. Whatever you want to do. Whatever. Yeah, because uh, this is random. We're not going to, I'm not going to do this. Okay, so you're going to, okay. Okay, you want me to do it? No, I don't. Mm -hmm. I just want you to do something. Decide. Or you want to go play in that nest. Or jump over the lava pit. No, definitely not the lava pit. What happens in the nest? You could gain somebody. You could gain a skull. But it's really high. No. Mm -mm. Inter then inter I might as well kill this guy. This is silly. This is silly. This is silly. Because you need me over there to be a damage taker. We're going to wreck this spider. Okay, fine. Eight. Two. Miss. That's it, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Oh, uh, I didn't go with Your guy. Captain. So Captain's going to move here, and I'm going to actually circle it. Let's look at the top three hits. Oh. All right. All right. Let's see if there's anything good in here. Failure, not good, not good. So we'll We do want this. the tricky four legs. Yeah. Put that tricky four legs up there. All right. Mm -hmm. Monster's turn. Your turn. You know what it is. This. This mood flips with this mood. Now we can't move away from spiderlings. Oh, no. Uh, Why did you that? tell me that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's coming oh, back. Excuse me. Yeah. That's it. Spiderling now attacks you. For a four? Miss. Miss. 
Counter. Right. Can I counter? No, that's my door. Ugh, okay. All right, our turn to start wreaking house on this guy. Okay. Marry you start? Sure. Move me in there. Oh, gosh. Get out of here. Here. One, two, three, four, five. Excellent. Do it up. Okay, two attacks hitting on fives with the bone axe. Oh, critical hit, but it's critical wound, right? It's a critical wound. Okay, all right. Well, we're going to do the tricky four legs. Correct. Okay. There's no criticals on this, so it doesn't matter. So I wound on a three. My strength is plus two, four, five. Yeah, wound on a three. You have so plus two strength, so yeah. Hit on a three. Yep, cut this other leg off. Cut it! Three. Did it bounce off <laughs> it of this guy? <laughs> it did. It, did. it sent him into a daze, hopefully. All right, down to four. Okay, so this is the other one. This is the segmented knee joint, and I don't want to fail on this. So the only problem is, um, I guess when you fight lower level spiders, mm -hmm. it's really hard to cut all eight legs off. Because we can't. We've done three wounds right now. We can't cut all eight because he'll be dead before beforehand. Right. Hey, they're wounds. I'll take them without nine. nine. Nice. Because there was a ooh, failure on this. Ooh, 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 ooh. No. She didn't listen. No, I don't have any Three. Okay, so he just has fling and this other mood. So three health left. This spider's a joke. Okay, don't test him. He's a him. joke. Don't test him right now. I'm going now. after him. One, two, three, four, five. Whoa, 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 whoa. Do we need to plan who's going to be the one that gets no. attacked? With a basic action? No. Oh, okay. One, two, oh, three, Oh, you're going to do two five. damage to him right now? I have to do three to one. All right. Samus is moving underneath. I got the club. I hit on sixes. That's not Samus. That's Captain Falcon. That's what I meant. Hit on sixes. Who hits? Two. Oh, gosh. Hits. What's the matter? Oh, tricky four I'm going to cut off another leg. Three, so I wound on a four with the tricky four legs. Nice. Do you have luck? Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. There's no criticals on this. Oh, there's no this. criticals. I didn't listen. I didn't uh -huh. listen. Mm, okay. I already forgot. So this one. Segmented tarsus. So this is a reflex. So you don't want to miss this because he's going to. Well, it's a reflex. It happens no matter what. Unless oh. I critical. No, that's not no. A critical. It's a wound. Though. Full move spider cleaves away from all threats. Cancel all hits now out of range. Full move spiderlings toward the attacker. Oh, so the spider only leaves me. Away from all threats. Cancel all hits now. Oh, so he backs up and then he goes towards the attacker. Full move away from all threats. Yeah, this is spiderlings. Oh, spider. Spiderlings, yeah. It's just like the last one. One, two, three, four. Oh, I think this is imp impassable. It is. It is. One, two, three, four. He's not going to go with a lava pit. Well, he's trying to get closer to me. Oh, okay. Uh, oh, so he just moves away. But guess what? He what? has four less movement from the... He only moves seven spaces. Oh, only seven? One, two, three, four. This is probably easier. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. He's he's cut up. He's injured. He's down to one wound, so. Right. Okay, well now I'm Yeah, go take out the spider. No. Again? Oh okay, what do you no, you know, you do what you want to do. Just move. You just wanna move. Miss. That's it. Mm -hmm. New round. Spider. It just does basic action. Spider. This is six. Closer to start facing. Oh, great. He's going to come and beat up Mario. Oh, no. Mario might take one damage. There you go. Two attacks. Mario hits on threes. Does he have minus one evasion? No. Does he? That was Bowser. That's why we killed him. Yeah, but why does why is this over here at the minus? I don't know what you do with your dials. Do you have plus one on your sheet? No. 
You don't have plus one on your I shoot? I don't have, no, I don't. Okay, so that I... means you don't have any evasion. Correct. Okay. So, so I'm at zero. So, so he hits on twos. I knew. You shouldn't have put him in front. Two hits. Oh, Mario's only going to take two hits. Hand and waist. I'm pretty sure you're safe. Light. And your and armor. Critical. And critical. Critical. And zero. Because your armor. Because I He ripped Mario's pants off. <laughs> he did. He did. Spiderling. His overalls. Spiderling. Attacks. Where did we hear that joke? Oh, yeah. What type of overalls does Mario wear? Denim, denim, denim. Denim, denim, denim. denim. <laughs> denim, denim, denim. It's pretty good. I don't remember where we heard that. Poker. Before. We listened to them when we heard on poker. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We did. Okay. All right, you want to keep playing? Oh, uh, yeah, go. sure. Okay, what's happening? He's almost dead. All right, I'm going to just attack you. I hit. You're attacking me? Waist. Yeah, this little spider Her. hit you in the waist. Yeah, you've got armor. Armor. Our turn. Are you ready to beat this monster? Yeah, move Mario in. Let's do it. Yeah. Do it. Hitting on fives. Two. Probably uh -huh. should have. We probably should have. Cutting four legs. This is an easy. The attacker's within two. Ooh. Ooh. Ah. Let's do the segmented arms first. Okay, why? Is cutting four legs really bad? I don't actually didn't really want to even read it. Why? Well, I don't know, because we kill it and nothing happens if you wound here. Okay, so I wound on a what? A three? Yes. Boom. Segmented arms. Killed it. It rears up and swipes at the attacker of the attackers within two spaces and the spider cliffs. They suffer bash and knock back five. Doesn't matter. The spider's dead. So the spiderlings instantly die as well? I actually am not sure. sure. I'm not so sure. Probably. Probably happens. Okay, well, do you want me to get my attack in just in case yeah, I don't? Yeah, while I look at this. Okay, come on, Samus. Seven. Nope, miss. I'm pretty sure we just win as soon as we kill the spider. Either way, I'll find out, but I don't think that one spiderling's going to kill us. Okay, well, I missed him again. Okay. I killed him. With who? I don't know if I moved and did something. No, you can't get there this turn. Okay. I killed him. All right, look. When we defeat the spider... What happens? The settlement gains the silk refining innovation. When the survivors defeat the spider cliffs, they suffer the revenge... If Taken is already anywhere on the timeline, trigger it now. It's not. Otherwise, nominate a victorious survivor and remove them from the settlement. They are kidnapped by the vengeful Spiderclis. Add Taken, survivor's name, to the timeline four lantern years from now. The group gains the following rewards. Whoa. So I don't know what Taken does. It's a, it's a timeline. He steals somebody. Well, I guess, but even though we killed him. He can't steal Mario because Mario has to fight him. If Mario is available, he has to go on the fight with the spider. So he still could take Mario, but I don't know what this is going to do. We take it. You don't know what it's going to do. Yeah. So you're thinking it could be something positive. No, I no. don't. Well, Mario doesn't have any evasion on him. All right, so Mario got taken. Right? Sure. How how good are we, our, our other... Do you, have, do you have our timeline sheet? I do. Timeline sheet. One, two, three, four. Which one? Number six. So at the end of year six? Is that the real timeline sheet? Yeah, it says Mushroom Kingdom. Survival Limit 4. Yeah, yeah. Young Rivals. It's not, no. it's not it. What it's do you mean? It, you can write it in. You can write it in. That's not the Sun one. That's the one that you started writing in before we got the, before I printed the Sun one out. Which I have somewhere. 
So just write it no, in so we have your... This is it. Okay, so so do you see the monsters that we fight at the end? The gold, the gold smoke knight? This one got too much rest. She's... She's... I'm too feisty. Feisty is the right word. Okay, 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 wait. I'm not set, I'm not settled that Mario's the one that gets taken. He does have the most strength, though. Yeah, I like that. I, I like that. Zelda and Captain Falcon. Or Samus. Samus. Well, Samus is going to level up. Is, Sam is Falcon going to level yeah. up? No. no. Not. You can take Captain Falcon. Because Mario's got the plus one strength. He's got plus two strength. Okay. Yeah, let's take Captain Falcon. That's fine. Okay. So why don't you just write Captain Falcon. in there? And oh, we'll double check when we set up the settlement phase. We'll find the right piece of paper. Okay. So we get the silk refining. And we get four basic and four spider quiz resources. Okay, okay, okay. Although, <clears throat> these weren't as exciting as I thought because you figure there's silk in there. But I think there's only one silk in that whole I don't, I'm actually not sure. Thing. Here's our basics. You can do, Now, again... This is an expansion. These expansions didn't get updated with the 1.5 rules. So what does that mean? Well, even if you fight, you know, I think in later rules you got more resources. And you got more basic resources for a level 2 and a level 3 spider. And I haven't seen that yet with this version. They didn't update it. So if anyone's watching and you've heard that they've upgraded the spider quest at all, let us know. It's we not going to matter. It's not going to matter with the level one, but no, not right now. So we need some organs. We do need some organs. We don't need hide. Organs, what we like. We want some monster grease. Love juice. That's an organ. Yeah. Skull. Oh. When you gain this, a survivor of your choice gains plus one insanity. Um, I think. <clears throat> well, he's got one. She's got two. How many does Zelda have? Uh, I, Captain had zero, and Zelda had zero. So well, let's, let's give, give it to her. Zelda. Yep. Okay. I got it right here. Okay. Just fix my dial. And then one more, one more, one more. Nope. Okay. All right. Here's some of the new stuff now. Why don't here? Just, you do all the honors. Wow. Is it my birthday? I hope not. I didn't. Okay. We need organs. Stomach. It looks like normal. Consume. Archive this card to gain one hunt XP. Oh, that's pretty cool. Mm. Okay. Two. Thick web silk. So there is silk yeah, in here. There's just one. Silk and I pulled it. Impossible to pierce. I bet we need this to make specific armor. Oh, because that one's silk. Di oh, different then. Yeah. Okay, so let me put the two oh, regular. Good job. Thank you. Two more. Let's do another organ. Small appendages. The inner hands look, look surprisingly human. Yeah, they do. What are they? Is that hide? Yeah. Okay. yeah. One more. Organ scrap. More complex than any device. A spinneret. Okay, well, the organ will... This cool. will go toward innovation. I like it. I'm sure we're going to need that. And we'll figure that out when we set up the, the board. Maybe we can start crafting some silk armor. I hope so. Back from the settlement... Uh, three people, actually everyone gained experience, mm -hmm. even though Mario was taken, or no, Falcon was taken to gain experience. He only gained one, but the other three actually level up. Right. Right, so we'll start with that, which is under... Gain endeavors. Yeah, we gained four endeavors. Okay. Okay. All right. So start your age, you roll 2d10s. So now we can start gaining hunt experience. I mean, um, weapon okay, proficiency. Okay, Samus. 16? 16. 16. Whoa! Fighting art. Gain a permanent accuracy. Oh, excellent. Okay. That's great. Okay. And uh, Mario levels up. Let's let's do this, Mario. Sixteen. Eleven. Fighting art. 
Oh, do we have to put Vengeance back in? Yes. Okay. I'm just gonna pull this one. Whoa, 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 this is my character. Fan that. Come on. He's gonna gain double, double dash. Double dash. You can't dash, can you? No, that's fine. During so you your act, once per round, you may spend... You can spend your action to move again. And then... Zelda. 16. 16. Oh, really? Yep. I just had this feeling. Plus one accuracy. Nice. Had this feeling that she was going right. to get 16. So that's aging. We did that. Update the death count. No. Uh, random event. Fighting art? Where does this go? Gotcha. Oh, right there. Uh, check. Milestone. There's no, yeah, there's no, nope. There's no uh, story event this year. Okay. Next year there is one, though, I, I saw. So, give me a roll. Let's see if we can make it through this year again. Eight. Elder okay. Council. Okay, it's not murder. It's not murder. The elders of the settlement gather to... Uh, they, I get, they gather to talk. Uh, over the hard-won scars. Count the total number of... Reminisce. Oh, gotcha. Thank, they reminisce. Thanks, thank, thank you so You're much. You're welcome. I wanted to see what word it was. Count the total number of hunt experience among all survivors. Add the bonuses and consult the table. We don't have any of the bonuses, so I think we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Where's our characters? You had the pile of them over there somewhere. Seven... Hold on. Well, I think it's going to be 7 to 20. 7, 8, 9. Where's... Oh, 10, 11. I don't think it's going up to 20, right? It's 11. Okay. Eh, this is good and bad. Bad because it completely foils our plans of what we were going to do this year. So we lose two endeavors. The elders teach up to two survivors with zero hunt experience and old trick. They each gain plus one permanent accuracy and ten survival. So pretty cool because two people start off pretty great. Amazing. So the first, the top two were Yoshi and Jigglypuff. Okay. Do you want to go with that? Yeah, let's or do it. Or would you like to pick someone specific? No, Yoshi and Jigglypuff. Because I... Plus accuracy. Okay. And 10 survival, our, our survival element's 4, so just rate 4. 4? That's it, so we only have 2 experience. And or four. 2 endeavors. Now here's... This is why it kind of messed us up, because... Um, on the... Sacred Pool... Okay, I think this is what everyone was telling me to do, but I maybe I thought it was under a different level, was doing purification ceremony. That one year that we had a like ton seven of endeavors. endeavors, we're like, what, should we, what can we spend them on? We should have been purifying people. Uh, because uh, you may endeavor here once per lifetime. Your body Did Charles infused, tell us to do that? Because we always should Your body is infused with the sacred water and purified. You cannot depart this year. Gain the protective disorder and you roll a die. On an 8+, plus, you get the permanent of your choice. If not, one strength or accuracy. So we could just be have been doing this that one year where I don't even know what we were trying to do. Gain understanding. So this year we were going to... Do it to two people. Do it to two people. Um, but we can't. Because I did see that next year's event, just so you know, you need to have people that are purified. So we're not going to be able to actually do you it. You need to have... Two or more. Two. You need to have pairs of purified survivors. So no one's going to be purified by the time we do that. Because it happens before we, can we innovate. Spend in, yeah. So, ugh, sorry. I mean, spend endeavors. Yeah, and I'm not going to go... We shouldn't go back because that, that would be a little too much. But that's a mm -hmm. shame. Alright. So that does that mean we're going to innovate and purify... Oh no, we need two. Yeah. Shoot. So So we're not purifying anybody. We can't. Yeah, I would rather one person being purified isn't gonna help doesn't us. Doesn't help us. I'd rather get the innovation in. Okay. 
right? Okay. So let's, so we have two endeavors. One's going to be to innovate, and I think the other one is going to be, because this was pointed out to us. Stone noses. Yep. I think in the bone smith. Bone smith, bone smith. Or is it the organ grinder or the skinnery? Uh, I can't reach any of them except this one. It is not the skittery. Stone circle. I did not, not, I don't know why I put the stone circle. The organ grinder. The organ grinder. I can't reach it. I don't worry. I got it. Okay. Probably. Scrap the scavenge. Okay. Stone noses. Again, this is something that we could have been doing spent the whole endeavors time on. Wow, right. we're just sleeping it all. So on. one endeavor, that's what it costs. So on a on arrival, we gain a, a survival and insanity. So right now, for our one endeavor, we will build that. Okay. You know, I still think that the elder council thing kind of worked out. Um. You know. Do you need a resource to build a stone nose? Yeah, it's an endeavor. Just oh, that's it. Online. Okay. Okay. Uh, so we are going to be saving these items. We're going to craft our first piece of silk because you did need the thick, the thick web silk and a silk to just build some hands. Yes. It's three armor. Just start building the set. Now it is flammable. Uh, we are in like this heat wave area, so we got to be careful that the thing sets us aflame like the dragon, but the dragon does stuff with flammable, so mm -hmm. whenever we do ha go out and fight the dragon, which isn't, I think, until you're eight, you let's not wear, armor. wear that suit. But we still want to build it, because it's new. And then we are going to build the hooded scrap katar. It's the only weapon we could build with the items that with we With the got. gear, yeah, even though there's two really cool weapons that we can't wait to... Yeah, so two attack, basically it just gives you plus one, one more strength. Okay. On this compared to our other dagger, and if you have two of these, if you hit with all four of them, you automatically do a wound. So we'll we'll just start building it that way. This way, everyone now has an upgraded weapon. Mm -hmm. um, we still don't have enough hide, so we're not going to spend our one special. We're not. Oh, I don't even think we can. No, we don't have any hide because we used it to we're endeavor use it now. To endeavor, right? So yes. let's spend this to innovate. This goes away. Here's our innovation. Now we do have symposium, so we do get to select four now. You're welcome. Two and two. Wait, that's it? Yeah, it starts off small. One. Nightmare oh, training. nightmare training and storytelling. And ammonia and hovel. Okay, so. Ammonia is the one where right. you get, you could possibly get fighting a white lion, but I don't think we're going to be fighting white lions that much. And all uh, the parting survivors gain plus one survival. Um, Havel gives us plus one survival and survival limit plus one. So both of these I think are good. Storytelling ups the survival limit by one. And gain an understanding. We could gain insanity. Yeah, because we're not going to spend two, two endeavors. We're this. always going to use two endeavors. And what's for nightmare sacred. training? Oh, weapon proficiency. Yeah. Or accuracy. Okay, so we're going to do. Buy one of the basics. Probably hovel. So what are we doing? All departing survivors gain plus one, and then we get more stuff to the. Yeah. Okay, I can do that. Hovel. Yeah. Hovel it up. Put those back. Hovel. So what are we gonna find next time? Probably another spider. Right. It was a pretty simple fight. Yeah. I think. We got some new stuff from it. We basically need some more drops from the spider to craft the gear that we want. Yeah, okay. those weapons are calling my name. Supposing Symposium is an innovation, correct? Symposium is an innovation, yes. Simpo okay, I'm just filling out our sheet. One other thing that got pointed out to us that we did not do was when we selected our death principle and we graves. did graves, there's actually a little story event and a role that we have to do. Oh, now, I don't think it happens with Survival of the Fittest, because we didn't select it. It was automatically given to us. Right. But the principle of death, we do have to do this. So, the, the settlement decides to build a small 
monument to mark their loss. Graves, I need you to roll a d10. Nine. Nominate a survivor. Who's pretty badass? Samus is pretty Samus, badass. Samus, yeah. With tears in their eyes, the survivor takes a shard of rock from the graves and marks themselves with it. The, they cherish this mark forever. What's the mark look like? Uh, <laughs> I was going to say something, but I'm not going to. I don't know. Does Samus have a mark? A scar on her? What would the scar be? Do you tell me? I don't, I don't, I don't know. If you had to get a mark on game. your body, what would it be for you to cherish forever? If I were to get a mark, a paw print. I don't, I don't know. I don't know the answer to this. That's, this could be a dangerous game. Um, the survivor gains plus one permanent luck. Oh, a four-leaf clover? Is that what the mark was supposed to be? No. Oh, I don't know. No, you wouldn't have known that. Oh, okay. So she's got one accuracy, one extra strength, one extra evasion, one extra luck. How do we get speed? Uh, Let's go get the, the speed. Oh, with the speed, yeah, it's speed. Oh, oh just do yeah. the purification and select that. Right? Stop it. Okay. Wow. Wow. Pretty good. That was a pretty good year. Except for the now we miss out on whatever happens. So is that the only time it... No, sun dipping happens in year 12. Oh, cool. And year 19. Oh, good, good. Now I don't feel so bad because I want to at least do the event so people can see it. Yeah. Two more times. Good. Uh, we'll have time to do that. All right. So taken falcon was taken away i guess um or maybe he's still with us it's just a story event happens with taken there maybe mm -hmm. that's what it is mm -hmm. okay so um no i don't think he's still i think i don't think us. we can't we can't bring him out to fight i think he is actually with us because it didn't say remove him i just think when that timing comes that's when he becomes taken that that makes more know. sense you might want to read that. all right so i i have to say something I'm a little underwhelmed with the spider fight. Okay, do not go there. This was a level one. We had good rolls. I do not want to underestimate the spider at this point. Little, I'm a little underwhelmed. No. Mm -mm. We don't know what his trap Absolutely card does Absolutely not. We have no idea what the trap card does. I think we just went underneath him and carved him up, and then the little spiderlings, what are they going to do, one damage? I'm not afraid of the one damage. Okay, so answer me this. How do you get to a level two spider? We just say, let's fight a level two. Is that what you're saying? No, 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 no. That's not what I said. I asked you how. All we do is do just you decide. Get to one? He has 10 toughness, so two more than normal. He has like five more health, plus one speed, plus one damage. So, but we only get two more spider resources. That's it. That's why I don't think it's worth it. That's why I asked. I wonder if they upgraded it in the 1.5 version because going to a level 2, oh, you will get more nests though. So that means guaranteed more silk. silk. Right. Okay. Plus 10 or 10 toughness. You were wounding on 3, so that means you would wound on 5s with Mario on a level 2. What about, know, I think, I think, I think, what about the new Qatar? What about the new Qatar? Well, it's four strength, and Samus has plus one strength, so that's five. So you need five to wound. Oh, that's difficult. I have to wound. I don't know. It might be safe to do another level one to get some more endeavors out. I'm glad we're all getting the extra survival. I'm going to have to put the hobble stuff in there. So. Well, if we didn't do the spider, what would we do? I think we just keep doing spiders. Yeah, I think so. There's going to be a certain event where we can start doing the Sunstalker, and then we can start doing the Dragon. Okay. So I think we just want to get more gear from the spider for right now. Yes, especially the weapons. Start. Leveling up in lev mo um, weapon experience. Yep, weapon experience, doing the sun dipping thing, the purification with our endeavors. I think that's the right thing to do. Okay. 
I'm, and I'm learn the spider that. a little bit more before we jump to a higher level. Yeah, before you jump to conclusions, like he's some like Let me know what you easy think. Are monster. Are we able to go level two right now? Do we get any extra uh, bonuses from fighting him, and uh, or do we just stick with a one for one more round? Because we're only in year three. We're going into year four. Right? Um, yes, we're going into year four. Correct. Um, do we want to say anything about? Um, our uh, viewers that watch the Madara video and why why they're seeing a Kingdom Death Monster video instead of... Um, well, this is at the very end. I have to try and convince you to still play Madara today. Oh. That's going to be pretty tough. Okay. So, uh, thanks a lot for watching, and we will see you next time. All right, so we're appearing here in the middle of this video or at the end, wherever I cut this in. We actually don't get the silk mill location, we get the silk refining innovation, which allows you to build the silk mill for an endeavor. So we're not going to spend the endeavor for the stone nose. Okay. We'll spend it to build the silk refine. We'll use to spend the silk mill, to which is two, two basic silk, which we which have. Which we have. One bone. We've got the skull. Uh-huh. And one organ. We have an organ, we have this, the spinneret or the stomach. Let's do the stomach. Okay. Okay, so we're spending a skull and a stomach. So we actually did build the silk mill, but we don't now have enough silk to actually build the silk wraps. But we still have the thick. So that means left over, we just have thick web silk. Mm hmm. And the spinneret thing. And the iron still, yeah. Right, because now that it's built, we can then build the weapon. The weapon afterwards. Okay, good. Okay. I caught that or else everyone would yell at me. I know, I know, including me. And you can then convert, you can convert a silk into a basic resource, a basic hide resource if you want to for an endeavor. This increases our survival limit to plus one. Oh, so now we're plus two. No, it was at four. Yeah, then and then we gained five, hobble. So now we're at six. six. Okay. Yes. And the people that gained that extra now council, have six. they have six. Okay. Now we're set. Spider shark, spider shark. Please don't let that happen. Hey, you always mess up the carpet. You see what you're doing, honey? It's okay. Uh, it's okay. I'm too big. I can't. I can't lift up the carpet. I can't. <laughs> okay. Do you remember what's going on? Fighting the spider. We're fighting the seven spider. Health. Okay. No, I don't remember anything. Right. I don't I'll, even I'll know who I have.